Good morning, my little angels. Look what I have with me today. A toy boat. And I brought it to remind us that we're in the summertime when people like to go out in their boats. Have you ever been in a boat? I bet you have. And what did you do when you were in the boat? Some people like to go fishing or tubing behind the boat and water skiing. And if you're like Miss Nancy, I like to just go for a ride in the boat and look at all the wonder thing, wonderful things that God has blessed us with, like all the trees and the fresh air. So no matter what you do in the boat, though, it's very important to know some things about boat safety. Do you remember what we talked about a couple weeks ago? Always wear your life jacket, right? Do you remember that? And the boating season is also a season for thunderstorms. We should always check the weather to make sure that it's going to be good before we go out in the boat. But sometimes the weather can change very suddenly and a storm can come up quickly and then you need to get to shore safely. So in our Bible story today, Jesus and some of his disciples were out on a lake in a boat and suddenly, without warning, a storm came up. The wind blew so hard and the waves went up and down. They were so high that the water was coming into the boat and the boat was about to be turned over. That sounds scary. Well, while those winds and waves tossed the little boat, Jesus slept very soundly and peacefully at one end of the boat. And some of the disciples were upset that Jesus was sleeping. They went and woke Jesus and asked him, Master, don't you even care that we are about to drown? They were scared. Jesus got up and spoke to the winds and waves. Peace be still, he said. As soon as he spoke, the wind stopped blowing and the water became calm. Jesus' disciples were amazed. He said, who is this man that even the winds and the waves obey him? That's amazing, isn't it? Well, we know who Jesus is. And we know that Jesus can calm our storms today. If we trust in Jesus, he will give us peace in our hearts, even in the middle of a storm. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for those times when you calm the storms in our lives. We ask you to watch over us and keep us safe every day. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Did you like the story? Let us pray the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. See you next week, my little angels. <laughs>